we streamed our horses winning. Danny backed up wildly, and for a very terrifying reason, a powerful horse pushed its way through the thickets. Its coat was as black as midnight. On its back was as was a masked man wearing a long black cape knotted at his throat. His jacket and trousers looked old-fashioned, and a sea captain's cap was perched on his head. When he spoke, it was the same voice I had heard before. Ahoy there, and who are you? he demanded. Where did you come from? We could ask you the same, Ivan replied angrily. Thanks for staring us. My pleasure, an ancient revolver appeared in the masked man's hand. Hands up, he barked. Are you robbing us? I asked in disbelief. Are you a criminal? Sukmin blurted out. People call me that, the man snout. I am a bush ranger. Ivan laughed sarcastically. No, you're not. They do not have bush rangers anymore. You are a fake. All the bush rangers were killed 100 years ago. I read about it in the travel guide. The stranger's eyes glittered through the slits in his mask. So say you, but I am a bush ranger. Mark my words. And anyway, who are you and where did you come from? I was beginning to think the man was some kind of nut. Maybe he enjoyed pretending to be a bush ranger. Maybe what gave him a weird thrill, whatever. I did not want to keep talking to him. It was beginning to rain and we needed to get on our way. What we are doing here is our business. I snapped at the man. I am making it my business, the stranger growled. And why are you wearing such funny-looking clothes? Sukmin's eyebrows shot up. You should talk. You look like you are going to a fancy dress party. Ivan sneered. No, you look like you bought your clothes at a jumbo sale. The revolver swung from Sukmin to Ivan. Mind your tongues, both of you. Now you and me, we are going to for a little ride. My patience ran out. Forget it, we are not going anywhere wi with you, and we have got no time to waste. We are on the horseback tour from Red Hill. You do know where Red Hill is, don't you? I caught a puzzled look in the stranger's eyes. I, of course. If you be good enough to tell us the way back to the village, we'll be on our way, I said. But there be nothing at Red Hill. Do not be ridiculous, Sukmin said. There are shops and a horse riding place. And if we do not get back there soon, our teachers will send the police out to find us. Alarmed, the masked stranger swung his glance around from side to side. The, trooper, the troopers, you say? Best we get started now. He reached out and snatched Danny's reins. You're all coming with me, and no tricks or I will blow your heads off. He spoke those words, the sky opened, the rain sheeted down, and a storm reached around us.